Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Mixon here and welcome to Road to Max Tech Pro number 14 starting off today with um, my last of the flags I got left um, 2.5k I thought I wanted to make a little bit of money plus I wanted to make um, some crafting experience as well 54 crafting is pretty decent um, now I'm gonna try and sell them and um, buy some mage supplies and stuff because uh, I want to get that 55 mage as well and uh, yeah let's take that then yeah 53 magic woohoo 54 magic so we are about to witness the 55 magic of Maxim finally I got this one Oh yeah, I got it. 55 magic. I can now hide. I'll just get to sell these steel bars. Got about 106, 107 with this one. Um, I can now hide. I'll and my next goal for magic will be 68, so I can use level 5 enchant and use dragonstone jewelry enchanting. If I train up one more level, I can make ring of wilts. So I need 80 for glorious, so I might just start with that one. Um, I know some kind of weird thing to actually do this stuff actually make money you need really pretty shitty high skills and stuff but yeah I don't really care so yeah I'll see you guys in the next clip yeah getting my 55 craft in just as I wanted making some coifs but enough letter for actually 57 and then gonna make some green dehyde bams and out them Training my magic as well, so you might just see my goals in this video. We'll see about that. But uh, yeah, see you guys when I get 56. Oh yeah, 56 crafting. So here we are at my actual 57 crafting. Only get to round up some more experience here. After that, I can finally do some green dehyde fabs, start elking those, get up some mage levels as well. And uh, yeah, hope to get 63 as fast as possible. I'll get those uh, green dehyde bodies I got by then. So uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Just gonna try and sell these um, coifs for some decent money. I hope I actually get a buyer for that. And uh, yeah, see you guys in the next clip. After realizing I didn't really get to sell the coifs I uh, made with crafting. Nobody really needs them. I uh, need another way of some uh, training. Um, now I just am doing this little mini game from Runecrafting. It gave me 1k Runecrafting experience. I'm from 5 to 11 and I got my first pouch. And I can now use the Abyss. I'm gonna try and get 44 Runecrafting and with that I'm uh, hoping to get some more money by crafting uh, nature runes. So yeah, I'll see you guys when uh, I level a lot. So here we are with the next clip. I actually got 31 room crafting so far, but I got pretty bored of it. So I tried to complete some quests, and here is the first one: the Eyes of Clopri. It should grant me about 6,000 uh, room crafting experience, 2.5k woodcutting, 12k magic, and 250 construction. 34, 11. Haven't leveled this one. Close. Here, close as well. Um, so yeah, got my small crystal seed. I can uh, make this into a saw, which actually gives me an invisible bonus of tree in construction, but only usable 28 times, so I'll have to think about that. And um, next up, I'm going to train till 35 and do what lies below, which will grant me another 8k experience. It's not so much anymore. So uh, yeah, see you guys then. So here we are at the completion of what lies below. Just going to get to talk through this 8k room crafting and 2k defense. Tier the age room crafting three waters at a time. I did not level defense. I still have another um, spare 4k or something, so I can do some quests with little uh, defense experience. I have to get 3k till 39. I might just go and do the lost tribe and want it after that, so I can complete slug minus, which will grant me another 5k. But I'm not too sure. Maybe for the last 5k from 43 to 44. As for now, I'm just gonna train a little bit more and uh, yeah I'll see you guys then and here we are at the completion of the lost strike quest um this will grant me 3k mining and oh just a thought cutscene this will grant me 3k mining and then I can do wanted which is one of the requirements for the select minus 
and then I'm going to complete the select menus, which will give me 3.5k room drifting, and then I'm almost 44. Plus, I will um, get the proselyte armor, which will increase a lot of my uh, prayer bonus, which will be handy because I'm planning on training at bandits and stuff, and of course, with initiate, it helps a lot as well, but I would like to do it with uh, proselyte armor. Yo, this was his quest, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. So, here we are at the completion of the wanted quest. Hello, Sir Emic. Um, I really don't like talking to conversations, but here we are, one quest point, five case slayer experience. I now have 135 quest points. I did not level my slayer, because I will need another 4k, I guess, yes. Now I can do slight menace, and that will grant me press light armor and another 3.5k room drafting experience, as well as um, thieving and crafting should level up thieving, I guess. But anyway, I'll see you guys then. And here we are at the completion of the Slack Menace quest. It's pretty pain in the ass to actually get those uh, blank runes and stuff. Had to go back and forth quite a lot, but completed. That's the main point. Um, I really hate talking to all of this. Come on. Tata old bean, 3.5k crafting, room crafting, and teething, and now I can wear proselyte armor, 47 teething. And I'm just gonna train up this little bit. I need a little more than 1k. After that, I got 44 room crafting, can do my own nature runes and start making money. So, yeah, see you guys then. And here we are, the supreme moment. PVM Maxi gets 44 room crafting. Fuck yeah. Nature runes, here I come. I have been using some um, pure essences just to the fact that um, I didn't really want to buy rune essences anymore. I didn't really count what to do anymore. I'm just going to find a pretty quick way to actually do this because right now I'll probably have to use glories. And here we are with another historical moment, the crafting of my first nature runes. Man, I really love this. I can make about 35 in one trip until I get 50, and I can do Devious Mines as well, not a quest. Um, I think I might just go and train some more strength right now. I only need like 60 to 70k left. Almost leveled my Slayer as well, and uh, I got a pretty chill assignment. Gotta kill trolls, so yeah, I'll see you guys then. And boom, 58 Slayer. Finally got this one, 50k left till my 75 strength, and uh, I'll catch up with you guys then. So, here we are. I just leveled my strength, but I was actually too late to record it, but uh, it's not really a big deal. Now I'm going to train my magic. I want to get 60 so I can do the Mage Arena minigame and get one of the God Cloaks. I'm not too sure which one I'll pick right now, but uh, yeah, these last dreams are pretty weak to magic, so they should be working, and uh, yeah, I'll catch up with you guys then. So, here we are at the actual getting of the 60 magic. I've been alking my uh, own coifs just because of the fact that nobody really wants to buy those. So, I thought of it differently and uh, alked them. I made these nature runes myself. I'm almost 45. Um, so, I didn't really lose much money. I had to pay about 80 each for the actual um, the pure essence. Then, I crafted these, so I didn't really make uh, lose money on the nature runes. I did lose a little bit. A little bit, well, actually a lot on the coins, but I've made bank again. So here you guys can actually watch the um, clip of me getting the Collodian kills and actually get my god cape I've chosen for the Sardoman one. Um, this was basically the episode. I hope you guys all enjoyed this. This was Road to Max Circuit Pure number 14. I've gained about 60 levels, mainly runecrafting, about 43 levels I guess. Um, this was basically it. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to leave a like rating. It's really appreciated. If you're not already subscribed, please do so. And uh, yeah, this was Maxim. Have a good one, guys. Peace out.